My name is Dominique Gay. I'm technical director on Far Cry 2. So I was responsible for the team that built the technology and built the tools for the game. So we started working on Far Cry 2 in early 2005, so that's almost three and a half years. And more or less, there's three major phases in developing a game. There's the conception, where you basically define what you want to build, what's the game about, and then there's the pre-production. That's the period where you build all the tools and you prototype your game and you basically put the system in place so that you can then go into the third phase, which is the production period, where you have a lot of artists, animators, programmers and designers working together and actually creating all of the content for the game and putting it all together. So if you have four or if you have eight number of available processing cores, we're going to take advantage of those. Um, so if you go from a single core to a dual, dual core systems, you're roughly going to get almost 40% performance improvement. That's a rough average, a very rough number. Uh, so that's that's a very good scalability as you increase the number of cores. I think the Core i7 is going to be a very good processor to run Far Cry 2 on. If you have an Intel processor, you have optimal chance that you have a very good support for the game. We've made sure from the from the beginning that we had good scalability on multi-core system. So when you have a system like the Core i7, you're able to push the quality settings on PC from the CPU point of view up to the highest setting. You're going to get very good performance. That's, that's what counts for players, basically. What I love most about my job is being able to work with a lot of creative people, working with engineers, but also with artists and game designers and animators. It's a rare mix of different styles of, of intelligence, working together, being creative, and really creating something. I've been playing games since I'm maybe four years old. My older brother got a PC when I was a little kid, and I started playing on it. And I could only dream of making games, and I guess I'm the living proof it's possible to get there. Uh, I wanted to become a game developer when I was a kid, but it was like a crazy dream, and then I, I made it, so it's possible.